you welcome to my channel. I am Izumi Talks, a YouTuber on stammering, confidence, and everything lifestyle. We can do this if no one asks. Stay tuned. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to my channel. It's a girl, Izumi Talks. Thank you, guys. If you don't get subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. Okay, guys, I just want to talk about something very brief, like something that I feel I should talk about. I have um, young girls um, my age group who are really doing well. So far, so much. I'm proud of them. I'm proud of what they are doing. And that's one thing I really want to talk about that happened, you know, among girls. You know, most time, I don't know about boys because I've never been a boy. I've always been a girl. So let me just talk about this from the girl perspective. But firstly, if you're not yet subscribed to this channel, what are you waiting for? Please. Just click below on the button, that red button that has the word subscribe written on it. Just give it a click and you'll see a bell. Just turn on the bell so you get every of my post. I post as often as I can because being a student and a, 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 a YouTuber is not a child's play. But I try to, you know, to keep my words at least to post at least once in a week. I try as much as I can. So guys, um, what I'm trying to talk about is what girls do when they see that their fellow girls are a kind of, you know, going ahead, like doing big things, like they're into big things and like they are progressing. Like when I say this, I say this in the most honorable way. Like when a fellow babe like you who is into a business or who is into an um, academic career or who is into, you know, whatever it is that is, look, what I'm talking about here is not someone who is doing prostitution or sugar daddy. Like, I'm not trying to bash anybody doing whatever they are doing, but I'm trying to make it clear what um, the area that I am coming from as a person. As girls, I've come to understand that girls of this era, whatsoever they fix their mind to do, like, they are tight on it. If not for anything, like, the girls in my circle, like, the girls, I have their contacts. They are this um, breed that are really um armed to the teeth and like they're really you know mean about what it is that they are um, doing and for that i am so proud like i'm so proud that i know girls who are not just busy but girls who are being productive like what they are doing they are seeing um the results and really it's 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 influence me like i love it i love what i'm seeing i love what they are doing and i love them for what they are doing so now this is um what is likely to come into a babe's mind when her fellow babe is making progress one is that the dance girl um the girl might tend to get jealous now this happened you know among people in general like not only girls but as i said earlier i'm trying to come from the angle of my gender like i am my gender i've always been a girl so when a girl sees another of her girlfriend doing better. There's a high tendency that you get jealous. It's normal for, like, I would say in my opinion, it's a normal thing. But how you handle it is now um, what will now really define if your initial um, aim is normal or not. Now, how do you, do you go about it? For someone as me, whenever I see any of my friends or any of, you know, someone very close to me is away, the first thing I do is to appreciate you because i know that once i appreciate you i have killed every spirit of pain like i've killed every every anger or it's just every atom of envy that wants to spring up it has already been killed because because if i just come and say babe i'm proud of you please it, it actually means that no seriously i am proud of whatsoever it is that you're doing and like i think that it is the first step on how to kill jealousy appreciate them if you see them doing well and you keep quiet you will keep thinking about their success and you keep seeing yourself as a failure and it will keep pinning you and if you don't take time you are gonna do a bad thing so the first thing is to appreciate people who are going there i heard a preaching from pastor chris and he said other people are making it does not make you a failure keep doing what it is that you're doing one day it will be your turn you are gonna blow like you you're you're gonna be that great person that you want to be so um the number two step that i take as a person is when i see my female counterparts doing well the thing i love to ask them is to ask them 
what they are doing like some are very vocal about what they are doing like i have someone who is into real um, estate she's my age mate just about a month older than i am so as of now that i'm talking she's 22 years old she's a millionaire like a millionaire millionaire and she's into real estate and all that so like she's someone who is very vocal about every of her steps so I, I i actually know what this girl is doing her time like i know when she's in the bush and i know, know when she's going out to meet a client you know all those kind of stuff like, she's very vocal about it so i actually know that like this is her hard work and i've also seen her make posts of how she does some kind of prayers some back-to-back -back prayers and all that so like i don't even need to go to her inbox to ask her babe how are you doing this it's already on her page on facebook or on or on, 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 on instagram i just go and i see what she's doing and she's doing very well i applaud her and as much as i can i also try to support her brand like not to buy a land vehicle but like help her to you know make um repost and all that like it goes a long way help people that you can help even if it's not with money um you can help them to repost and all that another one again still ask them what they are doing like if it's someone who is not very vocal about what they are doing please still ask them for someone as i i am i don't think that i am very vocal about every of my steps i don't think i am but some people might say i am but i do not think i am i only put out on the um, media what i want to put out like what i want to know is only what you know and i i also know for almost every other person what people put out on the media is what they want to know and they hide the other ones but for someone as i am for example now if um a babe as i am should come and ask me um babe what is the secret behind your skin for example for example i'm just saying and a babe asks me babe what is the secret behind your skin the first thing i'll tell you that the secret behind my beautiful skin is what i see don't even argue with me like don't even tell me uh it's not what i uh when i say what i what you have to do is tell me hey, hey, after what and what next so I, I don't have to open up and tell you the other things but if i should tell you is what her and you try to argue it with me we will actually enter into that argument and i won't have to tell you my secret anymore so what i'm trying to say is that for people who are, who are not very vocal about how they work to to you know to a kind of produce the kind of results they produce don't be in a hurry to bash anybody it's their right they can actually choose to tell you their secrets or choose to keep quiet that is none of your business but what you have to do is to know how to follow different kind of people i, I don't know if you know, because what i just use now is an example just know how to you know follow people first so when i ask me if you ask me anything and i give you any first intro just hold it first and ask me mm -hmm. so i'm gonna go on and tell you what i have to tell you then another thing is you have to learn how to honor people i learned this um, rule of honor from um, apostle joshua selman apostle joshua selman that honor is the easiest way to get what people have like is the easiest way to get whatever it is that people have when you see someone who is above you hmm, calm down keep quiet you are older than that person you're more intelligent than that person you're, you're more beautiful than that person but that person is obviously higher than where you are just keep short honor with that person because it's a kind of comes back to you like whatever energy you you give out to people wait soon it will hit you back like it will hit you back to back and it will hit you real hard so i believe that when you honor people like it's a ten like it tends to come back to you when you see people doing good tell them that they are, they are doing good appreciate them like tell them in a if i in a in a family dilemma like it's good like when you see a girl who you know who is um brainy for example tell her they, i love how you speak i i love how you comport yourself i love you like tend to appreciate people tend to honor them because i tell you that in this way if those kind of people will want to spill any secrets they'll actually spill those secrets to those who honor them for someone as i am if there's any secret for example about whatsoever i, I do that i want to spill i'll actually spill it when someone you kind of come and tell me man i actually love what you did it's beautiful i'll call i'll call this i'll say ah, but i i just did this i did this and did this and that's how i've spilled my secrets 
to that person so um i think this would be all for now like this is just all for me so babes when you see your fellow girl doing well please appreciate them please honor them please ask like ask them first and another thing if you ask somebody about what they are doing and the person does not want to tell you please respect their privacy they do not owe you any explanation like some people love to live a private life let them be if they want to open up to you be appreciative appreciate them for opening up because even talking is not easy like it's expensive to talk right now so guys thank you so much for watching my video thank you so much for being here thank you for the support this can i feel bad somehow when i'm holding this can i got this can from the prince ibano mall in abuja and that same mall got burnt you know by a nine year in short please go but i just feel bad every time i hold this um bottle and i kind of you know think about what i heard that happened in the mall i feel very bad so thank you so much guys so girl is in the talks love and likes if not